We're here for the launch of Operation Galileo for the 2019-2020 season. Um, Galileo is a well-recognised brand in Lincolnshire and uh, we got a lot of support from the rural communities. We've been tackling hair coursing for a number of years and each year learning the lessons, trying something new, doing something different. So 2016-2017 uh, we saw 1,965 hair coursing incidents. We reduced that the following year by 600. Last year we saw 873 reports, so some really good reductions. Often Officers on the ground making a real difference. Uh, our analyst, our analytical work has been really effective. We understand more about our offenders, uh, where they come from and what we can do to tackle and our focus has always been to prevent offending. Um, we're getting better and better at that but the, the big news for this season uh, is that we're working with 11 other forces. Lincolnshire has taken a lead. Uh, we've identified who the, the top forces around the country are. Uh, we identified Cambridgeshire, uh, North Yorkshire and Humberside as uh, the other three in the top four and then a further eight forces for, for the top 12. They're now working under the Operation Galileo brand so it's a national operation. Uh, we're sharing information intelligence uh, with some work that was done by the National Wildlife Crime Unit we understand more about our offenders. They travel some significant distances to offend we understand more about their network and that will help us to tackle them uh, over coming months. Um, it's really important that we uh, tell our rural communities about the work that we're doing and the work that officers do on the ground to tackle hair coursing. Seizing dogs has been a tactic that's been really effective in Lincolnshire. We'll continue to do that. On the ground, uh, we've seen the, the likes of uh, John Devine from Derby was a, a prolific hair courser. Thomas Jaffrey uh, was a hair courser from Lincolnshire. Both uh, have been prosecuted and received substantial prison sentences as a result of their other criminality. Uh, the rural crime team were able to provide information that was significant, was key to their prosecution. Uh, both are serving long prison sentences for their drug supply, uh, but, but it obviously has a positive impact on rural communities in Lincolnshire. Uh, I guess the, the final message is to say thank you to all of the, the officers on the ground uh, and, and to the team that support us because uh, to keep Lincolnshire safe, to, to prevent offending has been our focus. Um, we all need to come together uh, and, and to work in a way that, that has real positive impact. We get feedback from local communities, from individual farmers, uh, from the likes of the National Farmers Union, Country Landowners Association have both been here today. They really appreciate the effort and the focus that's been put in by um, officers, teams on the ground and the whole of Lincolnshire Police. So it's a thank you and, and it's a renewed effort for the 2019-2020 season.